Hi, in today's video, I'll show you how to apply for an IPO on Grow. We'll go to the website grow.in. Click on login. Enter your four digit PIN. Next, we'll ensure we are in the explore section and stocks. Then you can go to IPO from here. It's telling that there's one open and three are upcoming. Over here, Ease My Trip is the one IPO which is open. It's open from 8th to 10th March. And this is a prize band 186 to 187. And minimum number of shares are 80. Click on apply. And you can apply for it between 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. This is bid one. Over here, you can put your lot size. I'm just gonna go for 80. And if you untake this, you can enter the lower price range like 186. And it's telling this much amount will be blocked. Can add another bid, say this to at 80, but at cutoff price, and you can see the to be blocked has increased respectively. You can add up to three bids, bid one, two, and three, and you can even delete the bid from here. Delete bid. I'm just gonna go for one lot at cutoff price and click continue. Let me quickly recap this. You're in Explore Stocks. Click on this IPO. Click apply. Bid 1, I'm doing just one lot at cutoff price and click continue. Enter your UPI ID over here. I'm gonna go for this. I'm an individual investor. This is ticked. Continue. Just bid 1, it's again confirming 80 shares at cutoff price. Submit bid. I can see the bid details by clicking on this. It's telling it's requested. It may take 24 hours to receive your UPI request. Coming to my phone, I have received the mandate request. So I'll open it. I'm gonna authorize it. The mandate has been created. I can confirm the mandate has been created by tapping on my profile picture. It's telling in mandates, no pending requests. And you can see live, it's still awaiting withdrawal. I can even see the previous pending or completed ones. I've even got a notification that the mandate has been created. Now I've paid the mandate and still showing requested. I'm just going to refresh it. Come to ease my trip status. And over here you can see it's showing approved and this is the application number. If I click on this, it gets copied to my clipboard. And when you scroll down, you can even see the date when it'll be listed on, that is 19th March. And over here I can even see the three upcoming IPOs, which are these. I can even view the red herring prospectus by clicking on this. And over here, I can see the past IPOs like in this at applied and the company is still not listed. That's why it's not green. That's why it's showing just approved. Heranba, this company was listed, but unfortunately I was not allotted any. And this too, this company too was listed and I was allotted. So it's telling I'd been allotted this many shares. Hope this video was helpful. If you have any doubts, do ask in the comment section and do like, share and subscribe.